Hello and welcome to another episode of Miners of the Nexus. Welcome. Welcome. Hello. It's been quite a while since we've all been together. Back at last, here in the location of my old town. Well, where my o old town was going to be built. Um, as you can see, Rastro has grown some hair. Yep. He's, look he's looking rather rugged. I don't know, something went on in his rastral bill or whatever he got, he's got he's got a nasty scar in his eye as well yeah he must yeah, have been beat up pretty badly <laughs> and beat up. Tapion has grown his hair out um, then Gonzo looks slightly younger he's I think he's more hairy as well I don't know and we picked up an elf on the way as well hi elf hello hi elf Fro yeah. Frodo's foot is that your actual name Frodo's foot unfortunately yes <laughs> <laughs> so you were named after Hobbit's foot then well, my great ancestors uh, were part of the fellowship. Oh, okay. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> and they carried him like the power of Frodo's foot. Oh. <laughs> I, am I am strong and hairy. The fellowship <laughs> of feet. The <laughs> fellowship sheep. The fellowship of the feet. And I. Uh, and be careful. Bardo Jones. Bardo Jones is looking a bit like a hippie. Yeah. Like yeah. Bob Dylan. Yeah, you know. Anyway. So here we are in the location of what was going to be my greatest project ever um, until Popo came and took me forward in time and it looked like it was back in time because everything was destroyed. Uh, and the idea of my ancestors, or well, my, they aren't my ancestors really because well, it's very confusing. Anyway, um, the idea was that up there there wouldn't be any destruction. What they didn't count on was that everybody's memory would be erased so nobody knew how to build anything. So although people remained alive up there, they couldn't actually build the crap. Um, this little tunnel down here has been a new addition that we've added. Then Gonzo has built this. It's actually a train station that leads up into the island. So we've got that built. We'll show you that at a later date. So if we fly all the way up... Back in my day, I couldn't actually fly, so I couldn't get up here this easily. So, yeah, this is a mess, pretty much. This is what was left behind by the builders of an ancient Conveniently, sand. they did the difficult part, the, sphere, the glass sphere. Yeah, the glass sphere. That, that would have been hell to build. We actually placed that on with MC Edit. Um, there's actually... <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> had to break character from time to time, or else it's very confusing. This was done with MC Edit, but you can actually get... Uh, programs online that show you how to do the different layers of the sphere. I've got one. I've got a nice sphere in my single player. Good to know. It's good to know. Good to know. But so it's it, ca it can be done. And it I can did be it alone done. and in survival mode. Well, check out oh. our last Christmas special when we did the snowman. We did three three spheres and it took us absolutely ages. <laughs> and so the library. <laughs> and the library, yeah, we did domes in the library. So we, it, we have done it before. No point repeating that. So we MC edited the crap out of it. So anyway, shall we get cracking on this? Shall we explain what we're doing? Yeah. Go for it. Go okay. for it. Go for it. These, these you know, structure things are going to have to go. This is the old stuff. We're going to replace all that this is amateur amateur hour, amateur yeah. this stuff over here yeah i did the plans for them but it seems that they didn't read them correctly they weren't finished <laughs> so this grass thing is going to be the new the new um structure it's going to have like a foyer 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 yeah foyer yeah uh <laughs> fire fire it's going to have like a like a little entrance here you're going to go through here, and there's going to be entrances to the train station on the left and on the right. This is a train station here. Interesting. And then when you go through, you're going to go to the lobby, and then there's going to be an elevator that's going to take you up all the way to the different floors, and finally to the viewing platform, which is going to be this orb here. The orb is actually going to be built by myself and Tengonzo. Right? Yep. Anyone else? Yep. Care to join us? I'll, I'll be moving around. Whoever okay. needs to help, I'll, uh, I'll be up and be down. He's going to be the gopher. And gopher. double F. Can I call you double F? Frodo? Frodo's foot? Yep. Double F is... <laughs> 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 double F is going to be with Rastral, and they're going to be building the the main part of the building. So... The body, shaft. The body of the building. The body. Shaft. The, shaft. the shaft. So I think we should start... Get get cracking. We should start getting cracking. Get crack, yep. Release the crack. cracking. 
I think yeah. we should stop the rim right about here. So what we're gonna do is yeah, we're gonna re replace. Is. We're gonna break off the the blocks that are already on, and we're gonna replace them with this material. So the rim is gonna be around here. gonna say so up here I've actually done the little ridge that goes all the way around that's gonna be like um, where the viewing platform is gonna be so now under that we we're gonna do the bottom part which is what what then Gonzo has been start has already started here that's the bottom part there and that's gonna go all the way up to here perhaps and yeah so when you're inside there's gonna be a floor level there and you can look out into the vast floating island landscape. And uh, I, w I was thinking maybe leaving this bit here, a uh, couple of glass here, to give a, a downward observation platform. I don't know if that is going to be... Yeah, we can actually do that all the way around, but... Yeah, yeah. we're thinking all the way around, but, you know, for the time being, let's see how it goes there. Because yep. I'm, I'm, I'm working from the inside, I know it looks on the outside. I might have, might have uh, missed a couple of blocks or something, but I don't think so. Then we will go around it and check that. Then maybe we can do a, a bit of a bigger platform here to, you know, to have it a, a straight view down. So what we are doing now is, uh, as we said before, the shaft, the mm -hmm. body shaft. of the building. So shaft. what we're basically going to be doing is just building up from this base level, just all the way up, and then we'll find, we'll do all the fine details like the lighting and all that. Anyone want to add something, Team A? Team A. How high do we have to go? Um, I suppose <laughs> we I suppose we won't pass the actual globe, so let's do it to the base of the globe for now. So from the base of the shaft to the to the tip of the. the, tip <laughs> <of> the <bottom>. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> it sounds like some sort of, of weird medical examination, <laughs> rather so, than. It sounds like that that new book. All the women are crazy over. But which one? <laughs> yeah, the, the one fifty shades of grey. Oh, so this is fifty blocks of Minecraft. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so we should oh. build all the way from the tip of the shaft to the to the end of the ball sack. <laughs> <laughs> the end of the ball sack. That's called the gooch. Oh, the gooch. Gucci. Yeah. Get oh. get your technical terms correct. Gosh. Gucci and Prada. Okay, so it's coming along here. Um, I ha didn't actually mention what style we were building this in. It's it's meant to be futuristic, but I have this idea in my head that's um, something called um, retro futurism. And basically, it's like you know Fallout and um, what's that other game called when they're underwater and crap? Bioshock. 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 And um, that sort of thing. The Jetsons. The Me cartoon, the Jetson. Jetson. Yeah, that one. So, that is roughly the idea that we're having here. So this is going to extend all the way down, like the like the Gonzo has been doing there. You didn't mention that this was uh, one of the most requested uh, followers, did yeah. you? That we they wanted uh, islands in the air. Or something like that. We were actually discussing making islands in the air. It was one of our discussion points, and then when we asked for your suggestions, a lot of people actually said, I want to see Sky Islands! I want to see Sky Islands! I'm assuming that in roughly that voice. Mm -hmm. um, so, here you have it, Sky Islands. Still not too late to give us any ideas, any suggestions, things you might like to see on this Sky Island. Island. It's going to be a huge project, so, you know, yep. the more, more ideas we get, the better. So we're throwing all the shots out, all the, there's pulling, no all the stops. pulling all the stops. What have I said about whistling? <laughs> you love it. I love your whistling. I would have told you mm. I have sensitive ears. These aliens have sensitive ears.
So that's one of the sides almost done there, and most of the main part of the building. And the globe up top is almost done. That little thing on the top we still have to make, that's just a temporary thing. And then Gonzo's actually working on the inside now. Oh, can't get in. So she said, what? What, what? He's working on the inside yeah. here. Hi. We're gonna have a like a vertical um, vertical drop here view drop view here. Hopefully it's not a drop because if you drop from here it's gonna be good Vertical view Thanks. vertical drop view. And well now we have to connect the ball to the main building, the main yeah. shaft. Which is why I'm following you around, because I had to stop my works because we're going to join the two sections, the globe and the shaft that I've been pulling up. That sounds horrible. <laughs> 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 Let me rephrase that. Sorry, pulling, again. pulling up the shaft. This is yeah. Today's build has been brought to you by Fifty Shades of Grey. <laughs> Unofficially. Technically, the, the building is pretty much Fifty Shades of Grey. Yep. Yeah. The best book ever. Then. Have you read it? No, nope, I don't need to. Double F? I don't need to read it. You don't need to read it? I've reaped the benefits. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, say no more. Say no <laughs> more. Say no more. <laughs> N nudge, nudge, wink, wink. Say no more. <laughs> Let's keep please. it PG. Let's keep it PG. Please, please, please say no more. <laughs> please don't say that's no a, more. That's a favor. There's actually a mosquito in the room. Another of the negative consequences of summer. One of many. The heat, the mosquitoes, sunburn. Sweaty pits. Sweaty pits, sweaty testicles. Te sweaty testicles. Sweaty testicles. Testicles. So do you think we're going to get a few new female fans after this episode? All this speak about sweaty testicles and... Shades of grey and such. Isn't that what they're into nowadays? Sweaty testicles, really? I don't know, I haven't read the book, but I'm imagining, you know... And then the cowboy strode up to the... Strud? Is that even a word? <laughs> oh, maybe. Strud. It's like strode, but he strode. He strode I don't up. think there's a cowboy involved. There must be a cowboy involved. What, what, I mean, what sort of woman book doesn't have a cowboy character? So anyway, he, he strode up to the, to the horse and he goes... Uh, get on, get on my horse. My horse is amazing. Give it a lick. And it tastes just like raisins. And, um, he's got a sweaty gooch. <laughs> <laughs> uh, as, in, as a what consequence of about? Rising, riding the horse. <laughs> well, uh, wait, 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 who has a sweaty talking? gooch? The, the horse or, or the cowboy? Both. Both. Mostly. They both have sweaty because it's summer. It's summer. Things are sweaty. Um, the moon is rising, the moon is rising in the sky. The tides are changing. The tides are changing. Stars are glistening, you know. Vampires are also glistening. <laughs> let's let's leave the the rude book writing to the women, shall we? Yeah. I don't think we're in the same tune here. It's more like shades of brown than shades of grey. <laughs> <laughs> shades of poop. Yep. So now now what we really s need to start doing is giving the building some shape adding some stuff some goosh. Yeah. Some goosh. not in the middle some pizzazz. so i keep forgetting the no whistling rule <laughs> we're gonna have to have some penalties to whistling um what could the penalty be like a whip whip on the buttock Whooper. every time you whistle you get a whip in the buttock that should get our female fans going, shouldn't it? <laughs> uh. Somebody, somebody told me that this book, Fifty Shades of Grey, had some S and M. There's somebody. I can read you a chap a a passage if you wish. Okay, go on. <laughs> See, I'm interested. No, somebody at work was telling me that that there was a lot of like gimp gimping about and stuff. There's plenty of gimping around. So, yeah, share, share a passage with us, will you? Do share, do share. Double F. Let me find it. 
double F is around our, children. <laughs> <laughs> double F is our bard. He he tells us the stories and you know he's the bard of the group. He's gonna I sh- thought you were bard. Duck. I'm I'm bard. <laughs> bard. Ah, I'm a I'm a bard duck. I, I need to find a a good one, a juicy one, one. an appropriate one. And and here's an an extract from this wonderful <laughs> passage. Because I rolled my eyes at you, I can barely speak. Do you think that's polite? No. Will you do it again? No. Because I will spank you each time you do it. Do you not understand? <laughs> Very slowly, he pulls down my sweatpants. Oh, how demeaning this is. Oh, demeaning, man. scary, and hot. <laughs> <laughs> he is making such a meal of this. My heart is in his mouth, and I can barely breathe. Is this going to hurt? He places his hand on my naked behind, softly fondling me, <laughs> stroking me around with his flat palm, and then his <sighs> hand is no longer there. It hits me hard. Ow! My eyes spring open in response to the pain. <laughs> and he tries to rise, but his hand moves between my shoulder blades, keeping me down. And he caresses me again. Now his breathing's changed. It's louder, harder. <laughs> and he hits me again and again in quick succession. Okay, I think we've had enough. I'm feeling slightly <laughs> nauseous. <laughs> I'm, sli- I'm, I'm feeling slightly... Uh, Aroused. Right? Not right? Molested. <laughs> <Not lasted. laughs> and, and women enjoy this? I mean, seriously. <laughs> that's like, People get arrested for that sort of behavior. <laughs> <laughs>